the maharashtra government has uh, formed a special task force to reduce the number of covid-19 patients now this task force is a team of doctors who will suggest measures for treatment for critically ill patients and also suggest measures for their treatment in reducing the rising coronavirus cases in the state dr sanjay oak of the km hospital's former dean will be leading this team with at least eight other doctors on monday evening uddhav thakre held a very important meeting related to corona virus and the focus of this meeting was mumbai because from mumbai lot of cases are getting reported daily and there is a significant rise in the cases from mumbai so maharashtra government has finally decided to form a task force uh, this task force will be of doctors uh, former dean of km Dr Sanjay Oak will uh, be head of this task force and the main aim of this task force is uh, uh, to suggest the measures how to reduce the death rate also how to give the treatment to the comorbid patients uh, who are there admitted uh, already in uh, the government hospitals the government has also zeroed down six hospitals as a covid 19 special hospitals Authorities in Mumbai are trying every bit to curb the rising number of coronavirus cases in the city. Now after forming a special task force, the police have now deployed drones to ensure that lockdown rules are strictly followed. In this regard, at least 5 drones will hover around the city to keep a check on all the congested and the containment zones. Mumbai police will now take the help of drones to ensure that people maintain social distancing and there are no lockdown violations in the city for that one drone is given to every region in the city there are total five regions in mumbai and these uh, drones will hover over congested areas contained areas hot spots red zones sealed areas and specifically those areas from where in the past mumbai police has received several lockdown violation complaints so now this started with a trial run in dharavi and malwani area in mumbai and from today onwards all these drones will hover over the city to keep a check on the citizens to ensure that there are no lockdown violations. relations apart from this there will be two to three spare uh, drones available with the police headquarters which will be deployed as per the requirement times network has access to some shocking visuals of an isolation center in mumbai's dharavi area where the patients could be seen living in extremely unhygienic condition times network's kajal ayer gets us more details The situation at Dharavi's Rajiv Gandhi Sports Complex which is an isolation facility for high risk contacts of those who tested positive is very unhygienic all the people have been bunched together in two different halls and uh, there is a common toilet in each of these halls uh, now what has happened is that the administration had the idea that every high risk contact be placed at the same center so that when further testing happens uh, and people turn positive those people are not infecting anyone outside so that was the idea but the fear right now is that uh, uh, the nine people who have tested positive from the rajiv gandhi sports complex itself were living for at least 3 4 days sharing the same bathroom and the same sort of facilities uh, with all of these other people whose test results are awaited more than 100 people are right now at the rajiv gandhi sports complex and uh, uh, there is uh, a, a considerable amount of fear amongst all of them as to what will be their fate and whether or not they will also test positive merely because they were staying with these nine people uh, the situation is very unhygienic the space are cramped and uh, uh, the toilet facilities leave much uh, to be uh, to be done for